Today I'm going to be giving you a closer look at this dress. So as you can see, it is a fitted mermaid style, meaning that it's tight fitted through here and then flares at the bottom of the skirt. And it is knee length. Um, so mine goes just, uh, just below my knees, just like above the kneecap. So sometimes it rides up a little bit because uh, it is a bit clingier, but it usually falls right at the knee. And then it is, has a V-neck. Now, the thing that I love about this dress the most is the neckline. Okay, so it's not a sharp, you know, plummeting V-neck. It's still high up on the chest here, V-neck. And then it is tight around the neck. So this is kind of one that I think is so pretty with an updo. I hate that my hair covers it when it's down because I think this cutting right here is very nice. And then as you can see, it's got a high neck in the back and it's just really pretty. So that's my favorite part of this dress is the, is the neckline there. Okay, um, so yeah, I should definitely go for an updo today. Uh, the part of the bodice here that's lined is just, there's a line around there for the bodice and um, you've got a little bit of pleating up here by the shoulders, okay? And then uh, you've got a cap sleeve, which this is, you know, not too high of a cap sleeve. It covers down pretty low on your arm and it's got a little bit of bunching and gathering right there. Same thing on the other side there. Obviously, two sleeves. Um, Okay, so this is one that's more tight fitted, so expect to be able to see some lines through here. Um, it's a tight fitted material. What I like about this material is that it is really stretchy and it's also very thick, okay? So it's a really thick, stretchy material. You don't have to worry about this being like see-through. Obviously where it's clean and tight, you're gonna be able to see lines underneath. So just your underclothing, you have to pick carefully. Um, but it is definitely thick. The material is thick and clingy and um, it's just well made. Sometimes it get kind of like weird bunching around this hem right here, uh, but it's not super obvious just to me when I'm looking at it really closely. But um, so it is pretty, it's got a pretty look. It's a nice like little cocktail dress you could wear on an evening out or really for any event. Love the neckline, it's my favorite feature. Um, really high in the back. Uh, and with this one, you don't have to worry about adjusting anything or any areas like plummeting or being revealing. It's just going to stay put where it is. Sometimes I do feel like it bunches up a little bit that I have to pull it down just because that material is so thick and clingy that it just does that. Okay, let's talk about care instructions. Oh, and you may have noticed the pleating here at the bottom of the skirt. So that's just a really pretty look here. So let's talk about care instructions really quickly. Um, with this material, because of the pleating and the stretchiness of the material and everything, this is marked as hand wash only. Now I have washed mine in my washing machine in um, a laundry bag. So I did like a delicate laundry bag on a delicate cycle cold water. Okay, and it turned out just fine without any problems. Um, but just so you know, probably the best way to care for it is hand wash only, but I feel like with garments, I don't have a lot of time to do that with my dresses. If I've got a couple of dresses that are hand wash only, then it's just taking up a lot of my time. But I can do those on a gentle cycle in laundry bags, and then it's super easy. Do pull it out right away and hang to dry and kind of pull the material a little bit because it's stretchy so it will lay out smooth and you can either lay it out to dry so it's smooth or hang it um, and it will dry nicely. You'll probably need to iron it. Um, sometimes I pull it out and I see like that I've got bigger, thicker wrinkles in it. Um, so you can iron probably on a lower heat setting. I did a higher heat setting on this today and it was okay. Um, or you can do a lower heat setting and use some steam. I've done that also. So uh, those are the care instructions for the dress to take good care of it. But the material is thick and clingy, which I really like and feels really well made. I love the knee length 
you know, I love the longer things. I think this one I could get away with. I would be happy with it if it were a little bit longer also. So it came down like mid calf, but, um, it's really pretty at knee length and I love like the mermaid style flare and especially this neckline. That's just my favorite thing about the dress. It's so pretty and nicely fitted in the bodice area. Um, so with this one, it's definitely going to be a tighter, clingier fit. That is just the make of the dress. So be prepared for that. Um, and yeah, it's just pretty. I obviously chose mine in the red and I love the red color. It comes in black as well. So if you wanted a little black number, that would probably make lines and bunching or anything with a clingy dress less noticeable in a black, but I love the red. I think it's really vibrant and beautiful. And again, that's the dress and it's great for a hair updo so you can show off that pretty neckline.